This is our Swiss chard bed. Now, Swiss chard is a great plant that you can also plant really early in the season before the last frost, but it will also tolerate the heat so you can continue to harvest it all season long because Swiss chard is a cut and come again plant, meaning you're gonna come out here, you're only gonna harvest the outer leaves and you're gonna leave the center of the plant to keep growing. Swiss chard is most tender when the leaves are small. You can harvest them anytime they're bigger than four inches, but the ideal size is between about eight and 12 inches long. Now, with all the rain we've had out here the past several weeks, we haven't been able to get out here and harvest the plants as readily as we should be, as you can tell by looking at them. The good news is these bigger leaves are still very edible. We just recommend that you remove the center midrib, which can be stringy before you eat it. So this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna take a pair of garden scissors. Starting from the outside of the plant, we're gonna take the biggest leaves. We're gonna go down and we're gonna cut them about one to two inches above the ground. And we're gonna to continue to do this until we've got all the big leaves removed. Okay, so now we've removed all the large leaves on the outer edge of the plant for this, but we're gonna leave the center to keep growing. And we'll be able to come back in a week, two weeks, and harvest again.